Imagine a place so strategically located that the trade routes with China, Southeast Asia, and India fall in its lap. And yet, that's exactly the advantage that Cambodia enjoys. Rivers and plains dot its lush terrain. But what is it about Cambodia that American citizens have been landing here in droves since the last decade, a number that continues to swell? What makes the Kingdom of Wonders such a crowd puller? Is it the ancient sites or dirt cheap costs? Or is it simply the warm weather? It's time to find out. What's the special ingredient? It's a crazy equation, but Cambodia has aced the formula for converting tourists into expatriates. And it's a lot more colorful than you might think. One of Cambodia's top trump cards is its booming culture. But wait, this sauce ain't done yet. There are two other special ingredients that help it snag the top spot as an expatriate heaven. The country offers a delicious hot pot of lively traditions served with a side of a strong legacy. And then there's the common sense practical decision of putting down roots in one of the region's most lucrative open economies. The economic spin-offs pull in foreign investors and professionals like a magnet. However, Cambodia's long list of perks and benefits does not end just here. It's no secret that Cambodian locals have nailed the art of hospitality. Their charming smiles and warm, welcoming nature make visitors to their beautiful homeland feel like royalty. What's not to love about a place like that? Now, all that's fine, you might say, but what about the dreaded language barrier? Language barrier? What's that? Okay, that might be stretching it a bit, but with a thriving tourist industry and the arrival of foreign firms, that hurdle has been knocked down effectively. And it's good to know that English is widely spoken as a second language in major cities as well as tourist destinations, making the life of foreign travelers and expats considerably easy. And if all of this sounds fantastic, believe it or not, we've barely skimmed the surface. Now, Cambodia also has a very unique selling point that appeals to U.S. citizens. The U.S. dollar enjoys the position of being the de facto currency in Cambodia. Just think of the convenience this element brings to those who are looking to do business here, not to mention the solid economic footing it brings. Let's take a look at some of the other factors luring Americans to Cambodia. Strong Stability and Safety Safety and security are a top concern for anyone looking to relocate. Let's see how Cambodia fares on this crucial front. Broadly speaking, Cambodia offers a safe environment for expatriates to operate and thrive. One, of course, needs to exercise caution, as one generally does with any other place. One hazard that expats need to look out for is traffic accidents, as Cambodia scores very highly when it comes to accident rates in Southeast Asia. Another pitfall is opportunistic crime, such as bag theft. According to the Industry for Economic and Peace's 2023 Global Peace Index, Cambodia ranks 13th out of 19 countries in the Asia-Pacific region and 73rd out of 163 globally. Even though living in Cambodia is relatively free from unforeseen shocks and jolts, does it have a steady political ground? Cambodia has a turbulent past, particularly the brutal stint of the Khmer Rouge regime that spanned from 1975 to 1979. The communist Khmer forces under Pol Pot had a catastrophic impact on the population, with 1.5 million Cambodians losing their lives. Go back a little further in history and you'll find out that the 20th century was not particularly kind to the Cambodian people. From Japanese occupation to wars, Cambodia has weathered many storms. All this paved the stage for Cambodia to emerge as a robust democracy in the 90s, clearing the path for economic progress and political stability. This, of course, is a huge plus for Americans looking to make Cambodia their home, and especially when you consider the economic benefits. Economic Perks Yes, residing in Cambodia puts you on the line to receive economic perks like inexpensive living. The country has managed to secure the good graces of international living, making it to its list of one of the ideal places to retire. So, what's a ballpark figure on the monthly cost of living in a city like Pompeii? According to International Living, the figure falls somewhere around a monthly $1,250. And then there are some spots such as Kep, Kampot, and Siem Reap, which are the retirees' favorites. Their monthly costs also fall within the same modest range. That's quite easy on the pocket by most standards. Most retirees are enticed like bees to honey to relocating prospects such as budget-friendly living conditions while upending their quality of life. But mind you, retirees also have other reasons for crossing the seas to start a new life. 
and they can be as varied as taking a deep dive into a new culture, charging off on a new adventure, or adding a new language to the repertoire. Which is why Cambodia spells good news for American senior citizens looking forward to their retirement years. Those who have to dig into their pensions to carve out a living find Cambodia's pocket-friendly comfort highly attractive. Let's dig a little deeper into these pocket-friendly comforts. The prices of consumer goods are around 64.2% lower than in the USA. Take up items of daily usage. Not only are they an upgrade in terms of quality at a moderate cost, they also score points in terms of convenience. Now, in terms of clothing, Cambodia has tailor shops mushrooming in large numbers. You can have your pick and walk away with customized goods at a jaw-dropping low cost. The entire process allows you to comfortably call the shots from picking out the fabric to deciding the style and cut. You won't break the bank and will be able to make a new addition to your wardrobe for about $30 or less. Here's another thing that works in expats' favor, and that's the Cambodian system of taxes on imported items. You can easily get your fill of Western products at stores and supermarkets, especially in the areas with a sizable expat community. So, grabbing American ice cream whenever the mood strikes has never been easier. What's more, everyday grocery items won't burn a hole in your pocket. In fact, Cambodian chains have an impressive selection of fresh and organic produce, and you can load your cart with fruits and veggies without burning a hole in your pocket. But now it's time to make a tricky decision. The Best Cities to Live in Cambodia Here's a trick question. Which locale is the best to make a move? You can choose from Pompeii, Kemp, Siem Reap and Kampot. If it's a fusion of old meets new that you're after, then Pompeii might be your best bet. From sprawling real estate to tourist hotspots and shopping malls, the city can cater to your every need, and the nightlife is on fire. Now, if your vibe is more zen and you're looking to retreat somewhere calm and peaceful, then towns with a relaxed vibe such as Kep, Kampot, and Siem Reap are your go-to options. The cherry on top? Your expenses will plummet as compared to living in the capital. If you're a history buff and culture vulture, then just remember, the UNESCO heritage site of Angkor Wat is located in Siem Reap. The town also holds the promise of solid road and railway infrastructure. But for now, let's head over to Cambodia's second largest city, Batambang. Batambang is slowly inching its way to becoming an expat destination with its eateries, bars and architecture that highlights its colonial past. For those who seek to breathe in tranquility and live among nature, Kampot is the ideal destination. The quiet town by the river offers a relaxing sanctuary to retirees. With easy access to the Dam Ray and Bokor Mountains, it's a mountain lover's paradise. And here's the best part. Visa process. Acquiring and renewing a Cambodian visa is a fairly uncomplicated process. An E-type visa is the route for retirees looking to take up residence with a month-long validity after arrival. The fee is only $35, but be careful your passport should have a validity of more than six months. All in all, Cambodia is a heady cocktail of stunning scenery, economic affordability, and a much-needed change of pace.